All right, so day in the life of I went to New York. So this is my hotel room. You show people the hotel room. You know these hotel rooms in New York are too small, but it was in Times Square. I had to get a massage because that's what I do when I relax. Then I went to the Wax Museum. It was freaky, guys. I'm not going to hold you. It took me a while to adjust. It was, hi, Jimmy Fallon. How are you? As you can see, I'm inspecting. <laughs> I didn't like it. Uh, I thought this was Andre 3000, but it was Stevie Wonder. This is what William McCray wanted to be. <laughs> It didn't quite work out. It didn't quite work out, no. Look at me sitting here happy. I'm just a simple guy that likes to have a good time. All right, so I'm speeding this up because I just want you guys to see the different things I was cutting up. Oh, this was funny. I laughed the entire trip. Now, Lord, they didn't have to do Oprah like that. If, Oprah, if I was Oprah, I would cuss them out. Thank you for now this I was having fun but I got serious I love politics not necessarily history but I love politics and this whole area was political wax figures so I was just all excited and pointing hmm, the honorable former president Bill Clinton and former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton the one responsible for making the way for Kamala Harris. Now, they didn't have to do Martin Luther King like that. <gasps> My people! Y'all can't hear me, but I was having a ball acting like I was the press secretary. That was so fun. That was real fun. Bah, 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 bah. Kamala Harris. Oh my God. Ah! Now listen, I am just a kid at heart. <laughs> Look at I ain't nothing but a kid. I was having a ball, y'all. Okay, now, I always like to meet up with Safe Space private members if I'm in the city. <gasps> Tarsha Howard is a member of the private community in a prophetic voice on the YouTube streets. I love Tarsha, and that food was good. All right, it's like 3 o'clock in the morning. I couldn't sleep, so what would one do? I ate, girl. I ate. That pizza was so good. <laughs> all right, this is the next day. I was in the bed all day just chilling, and I went out at night, walked the streets, and look where I landed. Dallas BBQs. That drink was good. Almost had me on my back. And them chicken wings. All of a sudden. They were so good. And then I decided to ride the city bikes back. I had a good time, guys. And then I decided to walk Times Square. It was like 10, 11 o'clock at night or something like that. It was so good. And let me tell you something about these crooks. <laughs> no, these guys are super talented. But at the end, I have never seen Bishop is not even capable of raising an offering like they raised. When I tell you them jokers scammed them people legally out of all of their money, I, I was more amazed at how much money they raised through psychology than I was at all the jumping and gyrating. Anyway, it was a good time. Lord, look where they had me at the next day. I was at the sex museum. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it was it was a museum. Like it wasn't like a sex house or nothing. It was it was fun. It was fun. It was interesting. It was educational. I I I I, I was stuck. Like what the hell am I looking at? <laughs> okay, all right. I'm I'm I, I'm a child. I'm a, I'm a child at heart. What can I say? <laughs> Oh, God, what a wonderful trip I had. I had a wonderful time, guys. Y'all don't even understand. <laughs> I'm not even going to tell y'all what game I played to win this prize. You don't even want to know. Okay, he's cute. He's sexy. Yes, yes. <laughs> he's showing his age. <laughs> Yeah, I'm done. Then I had a massage fork out on the plane. 